Hey friends, this is Srikanth and today we will be solving this problem of Game of Thrones of Hacker Rank. So, Dokari are planning an attack Doraki uh, to usurp King Robert's throne. King Robert learns of this conspiracy from Raven and plans to lock the single door through which the enemy can enter his kingdom. But to lock the door, he needs a key that is an anagram of a certain palindrome string. Okay. The king has a string composed of lowercase English letters. Help him find, figure out whether any anagram of the string can be a palindrome or not. Okay. So basically, we are given a string and we have to find whether any anagram uh, of the string can be a palindrome or not. Okay. So the length of the string is in 1 and 1 lakh. And uh, so let's start coding so the key idea for this question is an anagram has at most one character which can be have the frequency of whose frequency is odd and the rest all other characters should have even frequency okay otherwise it cannot be an anagram okay so we'll do flag equal to has palindromic anagram and we'll pass this string as okay this should return an int and it should take string as input now we'll have to keep the count of frequencies of each character since the characters are a to z alphabets lowercase we'll create a 26 length array or a vector int frequency of 26 okay and we will create a integer variable uh, say odd okay now for each letter in the string less than str dot size i plus plus we have to first count the frequency of this uh, letter so what we'll do is frequency of str i minus a this will give suppose the letter is b then this will return b minus a is equal to 1 ok so that will be indexed to uh, 1 ok and so on for other letters ok so this will be equal to this will be incremented ok after this we have to check whether of all these letters how many of uh, the letters have odd frequency if there are greater than one letter having odd frequency then it cannot be a, a, a palindrome ok so for int i equal to 0 i less than 26 i plus plus if frequency of i is modulo 2 is not equal to 0 that means it is odd then we will make odd plus plus ok and then if there are greater than uh, one uh, greater than one element having odd frequency then we have to return flag as uh,
false that is uh, zero else return one okay run this test case so str was not oh, sorry here it should be s summarize this again uh, we will first pass the string and then count the frequency of each letter okay and then check if uh, there are uh, there are more than one letters having odd frequency okay if there are more than one letter having odd frequency it cannot be an anagram and we will return zero otherwise we will return one okay all others should have even frequency only one letter can have odd frequency right Let's submit the code. So, all the test cases have passed. Uh, yeah. I hope you watched, uh, liked watching this video, and uh, if you have enjoyed watching this video please subscribe to my youtube channel and share it in, with others to your friends who can benefit from this thank you